All right, y'all. One time, one time for the one time. Jim not automotive. So I am at home and I am trying to keep you guys updated on this Project Deadpool, this 05 Dodge Magnum that I got. Um, so this is my home toolbox setup that I'm slowly building up, putting together. I actually bought some of these tools from a guy with this box used. A lot of them are Cornwell. I'm slowly trying to add to it. Guys, this ain't nothing that's going to make you, oh. But there's a small little set of tools that I got for at the house. Uh, I got a lot of my stuff over here on the floor. Oh, <laughs> this might be the new mascot of the channel. Coco, say hey. Coco, Coco, say hey. My little standard poodle puppy. But uh, yeah, guys, so I do have something new to me, maybe to you all also. Um, I have been sourcing parts for this car from different places. So one of the places I found parts at was actually eBay. And there's a, a actual place, like it's a company, a tire company that was created and basically what they do is recycle used tires, but they actually clean them up, check the threads, repair any patches or anything that's needed like that. And they'll actually measure the tread depth and let you know. And I actually got this set of four tires for this Magnum, four used tires. And they're about six to seven, 30 seconds, which they actually don't look too terrible, guys. Like. It's pretty, it has a little bit of meat in there. Yeah, I can see uh, some of them look better than others, obviously, but I paid 153 for this set of four. So just in case you guys are looking for some tires and it's you on a budget or whatever, I feel like it's actually a great deal. So right now what I got going on, and this is late night, guys. This is like eight in the afternoon uh, at night. I'm trying to get a little stuff done. Actually, this is the rotor that was already on the car. I took it to work, sprayed that middle piece, scratched off some of that rust from right here. This is obviously the hub bearing. Scratched off some of that rust and painted that middle piece. Machined the rotor. And it actually doesn't look that bad. I should have painted right here, but I'm not really worried about that. But it doesn't actually look that bad. Um, I called myself trying to save some money by ordering on line on advance. And <laughs> I got the wrong pads. So I literally had to go to the store, return them, and get the correct pads. So this is where we're at. This is what we got going on. It is a dual piston setup. In the front, I guess that's just for the all-wheel drive. I'm not sure. Uh, that's another one of those tools from my home toolbox setup. Uh, that's one of the rails I have. I just got this high-speed ratchet extended. That thing is amazing. It doesn't have really much torque, but speed-wise, this thing is incredibly fast. And got to have that big boy impact for those tires. So stay tuned, guys. I'm about to rock out, try to finish doing some work on this guy, get it ready. I'm going to try to keep you up to date on the channel, so please stay tuned. Gemini signing out. All right.